second and one. Last pass batted and intercepted by McCants. Deflected by Spencer Hammond and the turnover by McCants. McCants with the interception. You, know, you get the feeling when you watch McCants, you, you get the feeling of a guy saying, hey, don't worry about anything. I'll make all the plays. But number 44, top of the screen, fights off a block, bounces up. That's Hammond. Makes the tip. And then uh, McCants has enough athletic ability to make the play. Out of the eye, Joseph and Danley in the game. They're going to throw it instead over to Alexander Wright. And McCants Swings him down. And this Keith McCants has had himself a first half. His eighth tackle of the day. And he's made them inside. He's made them outside. He's made sacks. Number 86. He's calling the audibles too defensively. As you see, watch his eye. He just has a few. Avoids the block by the wide receiver. Fights through a little bit of traffic. And then has the speed to tackle an all-American track man in Alexander Wright. Remember, the Alabama last drive was set up after the interception by McCants. Now second and seven. McCants. McCants just went right around Stacy Danley. Well, he may have gotten a face mask as well. It was a great play by McCants, who that time lined up as a defensive end. But on the sack, it was a power sack, just a bull rush. I think he got his hand on Slack's face mask. Bottom of the screen. It's a mismatch when you have McCants against the back. You need a big body. There's the, the easy call on the face mask. But you have to know where Keith McCants lines up. Is he at middle linebacker? Is he at tackle? Is he at end? And you, then you have to get a big body on him. You can't have a back block. Face yard. Face mask penalty. Five yard penalty. Still be second down. McCants told us he has a split personality. Once he hits the field, is I can't hardly control it. He plays like that, doesn't he? Bill Curry even said yeah. that he, yeah. he's obsessed with being a great football player, McCants. Let's tell you the Chevrolet most valuable players of the game, Alexander Wright from Auburn. Seven receptions, 141 yards today. They opened up the air game with Reggie Slack. And from Alabama, Keith McCants, 19 tackles and an interception.